What's up traders? Welcome to the channel. My name is John. We trade options here. So we're going to do a really quick tutorial for Thinkorswim to add VWAP, VWAP, Volume Weighted Average Price, and a really great indicator, but it is quick, simple, and easy to add in Thinkorswim. So let's jump in the platform. I'll show you how to get it going. You're going to want to be in the charts section on Thinkorswim. And then basically what we want to do at this point is a couple things. So you go to the studies section. So check out where my mouse is. I'm going to click on that. And you can either do quick study or add study. It doesn't really matter at this point, uh, but you're going to want to go to all studies. And then as I come here, scroll down to the VW section, you'll see VWAP at the top here, and that's right here. So pretty simple. You just click it, and you'll see right now it kind of adds you know, a line. That's great. Uh, but as I go into a tighter time frame, you'll now see it gives you upper lower bounds. I'm on the five-minute chart right now. And that's not too bad. It, it kind of, uh, you know, to give you an idea, I'll, I'll zoom in on the last couple days here. So let's go like these three days. There's some action. <clears throat> and the, the middle center line, that is the VWAP. So that is the this pink fuchsia line in the center. These upper and lower bounds, actually most traders do like to get rid of it. So I can show you how to do that. You hit studies, edit studies. And right here is the gears. So we'll click on that. And in this little section with the settings, you can you know adjust your inputs as needed. You know, if you think there's a, something to make it faster, better, you know, uh, change the parameters, go for it. But in the plot section, right here it has uh, upper upper band, declick the show plot, and lower bland, band. Wow, lower bland, huh? Uh, <laughs> go here and then you're gonna uncheck the show plot section as well. So just hit OK, apply, boom, good. And now you'll see, you know, the VWAP kind of acts as like the, almost like a mean reversion at times. But keep in mind, this doesn't always happen. So for example, you know, on today's trading, we sort of went past it. <clears throat> and you know, if you were trying to say fade this move, uh, you know, after the first breakout, to be honest, you would have missed it. It would have just kept going higher on you. So you got to be careful uh, in terms of your trading. VWAP's not the, the end-all be-all, uh, nor is any indicator really. Uh, but a lot of traders do like to mix it in with other indicators. So you can maybe pair this with like a RSI or a MACD or even like the moving averages, like a fast moving average, EMA, or a, a really quick moving average, like a, you know, two five, nine, something like that. That was a nice, easy tutorial. I got a few others here on the channel, so I hope you check them out. But more importantly, you'll want to subscribe. Do what baby Groot does. He uh, wants you to see all the quality premium content, especially trading options for income. That's kind of the money maker, the, the bee's knees, the, the good ones. So uh, I've always got those trades coming in for you so you can view, follow, and ask questions. So appreciate you stopping by. See you on the next one. Bye-bye.